Welcome to the city square and to the Caird Hall, here in the heart of Dundee. My name is Fiona Douglas and I'm the University Chaplain. Today I'm also your host and guide as we welcome you to our wonderful university and equally wonderful city. We thought that this was a great opportunity to show you some of the sites with a little history thrown in. I'd like to introduce you to our cycling team. And a huge thanks go to them for starting our day with a trip over the road bridge. So I ask you please to sit comfortably and enjoy a short trip around the city, stopping at some of the key destinations along the way. I'll join you at some of those places and introduce you to a few people. Our cycling team leads the way. So let me introduce the first feature. This welcome ceremony would normally have been held inside the Caird Hall, full of all our new students. There would have been an academic procession and great music. So here's a glimpse of what that ceremony has looked like over the years. This will be followed by a few words from our principal, Professor David Maguire. Hello, I'm Professor David Maguire, the head of the university, or principal and vice chancellor to use my full title. It's my great pleasure to welcome you to the University of Dundee. Every year, the university is refreshed and strengthened by the arrival of a new generation of students, each eager to learn new things and to make their own mark. You are joining the university at an unusual time for all of us, as we continue to adapt to the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. I promise you that we will do everything we can to ensure your university experience is as rich, rewarding and satisfying as possible. There will be challenges and we will all need to be careful and follow the public health guidelines. But within that, you will still be able to make a very positive start to your life at university. The university has a proud history of education, going back almost 140 years. Central to our founding deed was that the university should be used for promoting the education of persons of both sexes and the study of science, literature and the fine arts. These early ideals are very much represented in our mission of today, which is to transform lives by the creation, sharing and application of knowledge. This should come through in your lectures, tutorials and practical work. In your course studies, we will offer you the highest standards of teaching, support and facilities. I do hope that in your time here at Dundee, you will be transformed by the experience of being at our university. We are consistently rated as one of the best places in the UK to come to university. We are the 2020 University of the Year for Student Experience, a title given to us by the Times and Sunday Times Good University Guide. This reflects our consistent performance in the higher reaches of the annual National Student Survey, something that is critically important to us as it's based upon the views of students just like you. Combined with the results of the National Teaching Excellence Framework, which gave us the highest possible gold rating, our high ranking shows that Dundee is one of the best places to be a student. You will benefit from all of this throughout your time here at the university and in the years beyond. At Dundee, you will gain new knowledge and skills that you can take out into the world. You will make many memories and new friends and possibly even meet your life partner. Gaining a degree is the next great step in your education and a prime reason that you are here. 
But there's also a lot more to be gained from your time at Dundee. We don't just want you to get your degree. We want to make sure your experience at university is a rich one. One which gives you the best opportunity to find the career you want, to pursue the activities you're interested in, and to find new friends. The possibilities that lie before you right now are endless. As well as excellent teaching, we provide many opportunities to work with businesses and organisations all over the world. Your Students' Association, or DUSA as it's called, is a vital part of this as well. Together, we will do all that we can to ensure that you feel welcome, safe and supported and are able to have a great student life here in Dundee. Whatever you want to do, however you want to make the time here special in Dundee, we will look out for you. I believe that you are about to embark on a university career that is amongst the very best you will find anywhere. These can be the most exciting and rewarding years of your life. I encourage you to make the most of them. Work hard, try out some new things and enjoy yourself. I wish you the very best of luck. on our short trip around the city is the fabulous V&A Museum right here on the waterfront. This groundbreaking piece of engineering opened in September 2018 and is part of the £1 billion redevelopment of the city's waterfront. The V&A was designed by Japanese architect Kengo Kuma and is the first ever dedicated design museum in Scotland, the only other V&A museum outside London. It's a centrepiece for Dundee's rich history in design and innovation, something highlighted by its status as a UNESCO City of Design. This truly magnificent building is a must for anyone. As you come off the road bridge, you'll find yourself at the front door. Walk out the train station and here it is in front of you, inviting you in. The next person to join us today is the Lord Provost of Dundee, Ian Borthwick, who will welcome you on behalf of the city. On behalf of the city, I am delighted to welcome you here to, to Dundee. As you know, the University of Dundee has a world-renowned reputation for its teaching and research. Researchers at the university are at the forefront of the fight against coronavirus, and I have no doubt that they are doing everything possible to keep our community safe. Young students are taught at the highest level at this university and I am sure you will find the same during your time here. Your start to life at university might be a little different, but you should take comfort in the progress we are making against coronavirus. Over the past few months, a great deal of work to support those most vulnerable has taken place in Dundee. <clears throat> it has been incredibly heartening to see the city come together in an effort to make sure everyone has the care and support they need. <clears throat> and I am delighted to welcome you into our community and hope you will embrace all that Dundee has to offer. I want to share one more piece of advice with you that I hope is useful and helps make your time here beneficial and memorable. Enjoy yourself. We have some wonderful architecture and an interesting social and political history and the city setting on the banks of the Tay certainly makes Dundee stand out. Finally, I hope you are all well and enjoy your time in Dundee and I look forward to the day 
when we may be able to meet. Welcome back. Our little tour has led us to the University of Dundee's stunning botanical gardens. It's a beautiful, peaceful haven for you to enjoy and recharge your batteries. The gardens boast a wide ranging collections of conifers, broadleaf trees and shrubs, tropical and temperate glasshouses, a water garden and a herb garden. It has many indigenous plants, as well as collections from all the continents of the world. Botanics is situated just above the river and our airport in the west end of the city. Around 80,000 visitors a year come here to enjoy the plants and wildlife. It really is another must see. Now, we can't be here without mentioning the wonderful work carried out by the team who planned out these gardens, including many extraordinary features not least the building of this fabulous dry stone dike behind me. It's now my pleasure to introduce our rector, Jim Spence, who will be welcoming you, I believe, from the back of his scooter. Hi, my name's Jim Spence. I'm the rector of the University of Dundee. I'd like to warmly welcome you all to the university and to the city. You'll find this is a vibrant place with everything you need close at hand. It's a university with a great reputation for learning, and I think you've made a wise choice in coming here to Dundee. Apart from the academic quality of the uni, there's also loads to do, and it's all within easy reach. The campus and the city are small enough to be intimate, but they're big enough to give you privacy when you want it. Dundonians are friendly folk, and for those of you not from here, once you've tuned into our unique dialect, you'll find people who welcome you with open arms. For those of you who enjoy nightlife and a social scene, Dundee's got plenty to keep you busy. For those of you who enjoy sport, there are two professional football clubs, a pro ice hockey team at Dundee Ice Arena, as well as an outdoor velodrome and an athletic stadium. It can be a strange experience coming to a new place and to university, but there are plenty of folk to help you settle in and to offer you advice on a wide range of issues. Don't be shy to ask. There's nothing that you can mention that we won't have heard before. So if in doubt about anything at all, don't be. Everyone's here to make sure you settle in well. As your rector, I'm here to assist you with any issues, large or small, that you need advice on. The Dundee University Students Association, DUSA, will point you in my direction if there's anything I can help with. Those of you from the area know all about Dundee, but those coming from elsewhere, you're coming to a terrific city and a great university. It's the start of a great new journey in your life, whether you're coming straight from school, had a year out, or as I was, a more mature student. Last week, I had a chat with a guy I've known for years, a long-established footwear reporter with a major daily newspaper in his 40s. He's changing career. He's coming back to university to study. He's as nervous as I was many years ago, and as nervous as some of you probably are. It's entirely natural. I'd be worried if you didn't have a wee bit of nerves as you prepare for this big adventure. But you're starting out with great good wishes from everyone, from parents to pals and to relations. I'm sure you'll have a fantastic time here at the University of Dundee. As your rector, I wish you health, I wish you happiness in your time here. You'll discover you've made a great choice.
lovely cycle ride in through the West End and down the Perth Road, we've arrived at our main university campus, close to the city centre. I'm in front of our main entrance and reception area, the Tower Building. Our university prides itself on having high levels of student experience and satisfaction. So there's lots of services for you to enjoy right here on the doorstep, all providing a warm, welcoming and safe environment. I'm now going to pass you over to Scott Quinn, President of Dundee University Students Association, JUSA for short, and to Dan Sayre, the President of our Sports Union. They will tell you more about life here as a student on campus. Hi everyone, as President of Dundee University Students Association, I'm thrilled to welcome you into the Dundee community. Coming to university is a fantastic achievement and you should be proud of the hard work you've put in to join us here today. Dundee itself is a little city, but there's so much packed into it. Make sure to get out and explore the university grounds and the wider city itself. There's some iconic landmarks and beautiful sites, so get to know your new home. If you're studying online, make sure to attend the digital welcome events and get to know your new classmates. COVID-19 has caused some unprecedented situations this year, but DUSA and the university have been working tirelessly to make sure that you have the best education and the best student experience possible whilst you make your way through your degrees. You can find DUSA on the Dundee campus in the Union Building, and all of our resources are fully available online for those of you that are studying virtually. The one thing that you should take away from this video is that we're here to support you and to help you make the most of your time with us. Dundee is ranked number one internationally for our student clubs and societies. We've got well over 300 of them, so there'll definitely be one to match your interests or hopefully they might help you discover something new about yourself. We also run a free advice service that covers everything from academia to housing to welfare. You can pop in for a chat or send us an email if you're studying online. I hope you enjoy your time here and the new opportunities are at your fingertips. Whilst you're here, we'd please ask you to follow our COVID code to help us reduce the spread of the virus. Don't forget to get involved in the many Freshers Weeks events that are happening, both in person and online, because you'll get to try some amazing new things and meet some amazing people. See you soon and good luck. Hi, I'm Dan and I'm your Sports Union President this year. Whether you're a complete beginner or a seasoned athlete, there's something for everyone in terms of sport. There are currently 45 different sports clubs at the university, all of their details and links to their social media can be found on the Sports Union website. If you can't see the club you want, then get in touch and we'll help you start your own club. Getting on committee can be one of the most rewarding experiences at university. You'll gain new skills and open so many new doors. Since I joined Ski Club as a complete beginner in my first year, I've been on committee twice, worked for a student ski holiday company and been on paid trips to the Alps, the Pyrenees and Berlin. Not only that, I've had a great time doing it and I've made friends for life. So, how do you join? Keep an eye out for details about the online sports fair on our Facebook page. This will give you a chance to talk with all the different club committees to learn more about the sport and the different things that clubs do throughout the year. Clubs don't just play sports, they also organise huge social events and even trips away to different countries, so be sure to ask about these. Signing up to a club online isn't a commitment, you're just registering your interest. So, sign up for as many as possible and decide later on which ones you want to try out. After Freshers Week, most clubs will run a free give it a go session to let you try out the sport before you sign up. So grab a bunch of your new friends and try out some sports that you might never have heard of. To become a full-fledged member, you'll have to matriculate to the individual clubs. This is done online and clubs will be able to guide you through the super easy process. A lot of people I talk to join clubs in their second or their third year, but they wish they'd join sooner. So don't delay, you'll have the best time of your life, I guarantee it. And for those of you who want to exercise at your own leisure, the university has amazing sports facilities. The ISC has a gym, strength and performance centre, studios, a sauna, squash courts, sports halls, swimming pool, all here right on campus. Then there's the Riverside training pitches with a 4G training pitch and loads of playing fields. The memberships are amazing value for students and will save you so much money if you're planning on joining a club. I hope that gives you some insight into sport at the university. We're all very excited for the year ahead and we can't wait to have you all join us. Have you 
moved a short distance to the heart of campus called Campus Green. Many of our facilities, including some of the student accommodation, surrounds this area. The student union, student services and chaplaincy sit just on the edge of the green. A few steps away and you'll find the main university library. A step, few steps in the other direction, the Dalhousie building, our main teaching and lecturing facility. It's important to say at this point that your safety and well-being are fundamental to everything we do here. We want to support and help you in any way that we can. And to talk about this, I am delighted to introduce you to Leslie Sinclair from Student Services. Hopefully this welcome video has given you a flavour of the city of Dundee and what your university, the University of Dundee, has to offer. Your academic school will give you lots more invaluable information about the university and your academic studies. Please listen to this information, engage with the opportunities to share opinions and ask questions. This is the best way to get the most out of your studies. There is just time to mention the many varied support opportunities which we offer in student services. Student services complements the academic schools by offering that extra bit of help when you need it. We can help broaden your horizons and make opportunities come to life through our skills services, ranging from academic study skills to careers guidance, right through to advice on setting up your own business. On the other hand, when life throws you challenges, we can help there too. The well-being of our students is so important to us. We have services which can help you with advice and support across a range of areas, including general support, health, disability, counselling and funding. And our Institute of Sport and Exercise offers a programme of health awareness and fitness opportunities to keep you alert and active during your time here at university. The full range of services is available on the website. Just search for student services from the University of Dundee homepage. And the Inquiry Centre is the first stop to accessing all of these services, making it really easy to ask for help. And if you want some online support, try our dedicated resources, including Live Smart, which signposts you to well-being, healthy living, personal development and student life information. And Learn Smart offers a range of academic skills advice, strategies and techniques for successful study. But can I leave you with one very important message? Please ask, reach out to us and we can help. No problem is too small and together we can work it out. You are not alone. Enjoy your university the University of Dundee. around the city would be complete without visiting the magnificent Law Hill which dominates the city of Dundee and here we finish our tour. The law provides uninterrupted views of the surrounding lands from the Sidlaw Hills to the north to Fife in the south separated east to west by miles of the Silvery Tay. The law is a historic site. The monument that sits on the summit is a war memorial to the memory of those men who fell in the First World War. The Law Hill history goes back some 1500 years to the burial remains from an Iron Age fort. 
also discovered here are Pictish remains and pottery from the Roman times. It's a wonderful location and well worth the climb. We thank all our guests who joined us today and we thank you for watching. We wish you every happiness and much success during your time at the University of Dundee. I leave you with the wonderful views of the city and beyond. <laughs>